Hello and welcome to episode 5 of Minecraft with FPSA Baranov. And this episode I'm going to do it a bit different because I built all the stuff before this episode. Now this is a live stream. So first of all, remember that hole I dug down from my house towards the entrance right there where the sand is? I dug up a bit and then I built into the side, I built in this wood farm. I'll put a link in my description to the Minecraft wiki page. It's an 80% efficient tree farm so uh, it's pretty damn efficient. And also I've added a master bedroom and over here is a chest. I'll show you the balcony o over there later on. So this is just nice little bedroom. Sometimes I have spiders over here which I have to kill before that because it says that there are monsters lurking about. But this is basically where the tree farm is. Right up on the side. So just this episode is farms because I have a farm right there. As you remember there was a little lake over there. I flattened it out and I made a wheat farm on one side and I'll make either a cactus or a uh, reed farm. So this episode will be pretty short. There won't be a part one, part two, because my video editing thing crashed. So I can't really edit these videos. I actually had an episode five where I built some stuff, but uh, but no. And so in episode five, I built this house right here. So some of you might be wondering. Why did I spawn in such a place? No, I did not hack in any of these. And here's the tree farm once again. And it's on the outside. And yeah, I'll also show you I found two spawners. I found a skeleton spawner and a zombie spawner. So here's the farm itself, the tree farm but it's not all the way down because it's supposed to be 9 high on the inside and then 7 by 11 uh, 7 by 11 on the inside as well so I have some trees over here still but uh, I won't be using them anymore and as you can see there's a spider right there but I'm not gonna go for it because I, I found a lot of string uh, I went for multiple wood hunts just because I needed all the wood to build that and that all together. So let me go to my farm right now and get some get some wheat because I need it for bread and everything. Now, yes, it is sunset, so I'm gonna hurry up. The two spawners that I found were, uh, they were both in the desert and it turns out that the seed actually worked and it gave me an NPC village as well. So that's good. And I will show you the way that I would enter to enter my base like this. So if there is a creeper going after me, I'd go in here, I'd quickly climb up and creepers can climb up in fact and I can stand over here and beat him down and everything like that and yeah I'm sorry I couldn't show you episode number 5 uh, of Minecraft with FPS Abernoff the actual filmed episode because that one was like part 1 and part 2 like all the others where I actually built this house right here but I can assure you there was no hacking. If you know me, I, I could even like download it onto my USB and show you in school if you so wish. Also, another thing I added is a dog pen. I'm gonna put like wool in here and everything like that, like colored wool and everything. But right now I have just a sign, the name of my dog and what day I found it on. So this is like day six, I believe already. So let me make some. Let me make some bread to eat, because my food meter is down, because I was sprinting so much to get the wood. And one, 
gives you 2.5 uh, food, whatever. Also in the dungeon chests, I found redstone. I found all of these buckets except for one which I made on episode 3 or 4, I believe. I found two saddles. I found cocoa beans. I found string, and I used some of the string to make the wool. You just place it in a 2x2 uh, two two fashion over here, and then you get wool. And what else? I used shears to get these leaves, and I killed the spiders over here. Because some of them were there. Like, look at that. There's like how many spiders. Or there were how many spiders over there. There were a lot of spiders there. Now let's go and check on my tree farm, because by what I, yeah, right there. But what, by what I remember from it, it should start working, like, instantly. The way you do this is just, I have an entrance at the top so that I can easily access everything. Uh, everything from the top. And, as you can see, I just jumped down on that tree right there. Saplings, I uh, I should actually put a chest and a crafting table there. I think I have a crap. Yeah, I have a crafting table. As you can see, there's a spider right there. So that's what they do at night. They camp out by my place. Cause they're mean. So let's make a big chest right here. Crafting table. Move that down there. There we go. We have the area cleared out. Just make it one more for the winter here. I don't know why, I just feel like I should. Yeah. And you can find like the way that you put torches and everything like that on Minecraft Wiki. If you search up wood farm, I'll just tell you that right now. And I should finish up with you guys. So as you can see, there was a second tree right there. And it'll just keep on coming. So I'll have this chest full pretty soon. And that ch that other big chest I made up there. Because I had only this one built, I used the chests from the uh, from the dungeons, and I put them into one. And so I made this chest over here, and it contains all the wood items. So goodbye, and thanks for watching episode five of Minecraft with FPSA Baranov. Thank you.